up guys welcome to hiking with rut somewhere i haven't been in a while we are at dickinson's creek waterfall we'll get some goddamn exercise with the goddamn dorkopotamus come on and uh i need the exercise probably more than she does these days because i have put on too much weight so i am sick of being lazy and comfortable i don't like either of those two things come on so yeah we're gonna head up to the waterfall Maybe beyond. I only got a couple of hours, so we'll see how long we go. And uh, yeah, no more weed. I uh, quit smoking marijuana, so I'm actually going to be changing my logo and title and everything here eventually. Get the dorkopotamus out. She's on a strict diet right now for three months. Come on. And uh, so she's been acting up, <laughs> as most fucking creatures do. When they're told they can't eat something. I can't believe how much effort it does to do these stupid things. Just as far as accessories. She's looking good, man. All of her fur is growing back. She's still getting rashes and bumps, but they're not like they were before. I mean, they don't seem to bother her. She's not scratching and eating them. Hey, heel! I'm going to get up here where there's nobody walking after I put in a few minutes of exertion. And then uh, we'll throw the ball, give her her exercise. <sighs> nope. Be a good girl. Howdy. How you doing, boss? Hey. Oh, 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 oh. oh, it's all good. That's how they are. <laughs> a little hyper, a little blue, blue healer there. Get over here. Gypsy, stop. I need you to calm down. Sit. I know. Yeah, what was that? What was that? That's a crazy dog. Okay. You can see right now she's just biting at the bit. I'm biting at the bit. We both need this. So like I said, I uh, actually quit smoking marijuana. If you know me, I've been a stoner my whole life. The original point of these hikes was... Uh, well, just to get out, because I love uh, walking. But then I was, you know, I always love smoking weed everywhere, but especially in nature. So it was kind of the whole idea that I came up with hiking with rot. It used to be called morning wood hiking with rot, because I'd get out early in the morning. And, uh, and you know, I just been on this kind of rediscovering myself trip, I guess. Read discovering. Huh. And, uh, Kind of don't mind the results. I feel a lot better. Definitely have more money. That's always nice. And uh, my whole philosophy is suffer a little, live a lot. Which is also why right now I'm doubling down on the exercise because I kind of gained at least 30 pounds over this winter. I don't like it. And uh, most of that's so easy for me. I'm a naturally fairly skinny person. But if I get distracted by things like Taco Bell, <laughs> And I work nights, so as a cook, you tend not to eat at work and uh, develop bad habits like like uh, eating too late. You know, I get home at one, hit Taco Bell, have no self-control, get that grilled cheese fucking burrito they have. Oh, it's so good. So right now I'm uh, eating what I call fasting. Nobody would really call it fasting. Uh, I do throw Heineken Zeros in there. Try to keep it down to two a night, but still. Uh, but then uh, salad and fruit for a couple weeks. Start with a week. And hope that that, uh, you know, no bread. No, that shit. Come here, baby. And exercise. That's, that's all it takes for me to lose weight. I'm used to walking everywhere. But I have moved to a new house. And I fucking love it. And I'm very comfortable there. And it's very easy to be lazy. So what I need to do is do this shit and then combine that with all of my uh, video editing and stuff, which takes a couple hours. And stay busy, stay active, stay healthy. I got an amazing girlfriend who, for some reason, absolutely adores me. And uh, I'm pretty goddamn fond of her too. So blammo, blammo. Hiking with Rod. 
we'll get up. There's a couple of cool spots where I could throw the ball for her. And then there's what we call the stream of terror, where when I may have made a mistaken judgment and thought I'd just do like I did with my kids with her and throw her in the water, well, Gypsy's a very intelligent dog and sometimes takes things a little personally. So she had some issues with water, but we've been going down to the ocean and she's been getting into the ocean lately. No problem. So that's good. Well, she's just a hopping today. Look at her. She's just a going. I'm letting her walk. There's two modes. There's heel and then there's uh, this, hey, don't pull on me though. And I'm letting her kind of lead the way. I do got to go pee though. Let's go this way. Yeah. There's nobody over here. I could let you off and run around. Come here. Come here. What a good girl you are. Come here, sit. Sit. Go. Let her run. Be a derg. Be a derg in nature. So beautiful over here. Now, some of these side trails I've been down before, they lead to really cool waterfalls and shit, which you could hear in the distance. But this leads to, let's let her go. Yeah, she don't like that. What are you doing? Give me a stick. What's this? What's this? Go get it. Good girl. Get that stick. Yeah, big old grin. Okay, you know what? Go. <laughs> Beautiful out here today, though. I mean, this to me is almost summertime weather where I'm from, which I can't really keep saying that I'm from Alaska. I mean, I'm from Alaska. That's where I hail from. But truth be told, I've been here now for since 2013. Came here with one life, started a new one, got sober and shit. I mean, none of that would have happened in, uh, in Alaska. It's sad to say, you get stuck in the same old patterns and you need change. And I'm a slow bloomer, so yeah, maybe it took me a little longer than it should have, but. Nobody changes me but me, goddamn. And I had to really believe in the change and that it's what I wanted. And in the end, I believe I'm winning. And I'm winning my life back. Oh, better late than never, so they say. I guess, uh, I guess that's true. Uh, if you watch my channels at all, or any of my dumb things, you know, I know, I may not get as many views and Subscription is as I like, which I'm at 441 as of today, maybe 442 after the after the EPS store. I had them rolling. But uh, I get friends calling me now who have uh, quit smoking weed and shit, and they, they're asking me for advice, or they're watching my shit, or they're like sharing their experiences with me, and, and I'm fucking honored by that, man. I'm a fucking, I'm me, man. I don't deserve anybody's anything so for those people that trust me enough or think i have any advice and or wisdom to share with them thank you you know and this is what i want this channel to be about at its core it was always about being outside and yeah, i like that that works good just hung it off the uh selfie stick see it's my whole setup you got your battery wire and then your lapel mic right here let's try to adjust that a little bit right now I've already gone uh, 26 minutes burned 64 calories today I don't know if that's just on this walk or not but I didn't put in many calories because it was a uh, half a fucking cup of blueberries hey Gypsy you're pulling on me get back here baby time to calm you down gotta get rid of this that's where diabetes and heart disease starts. I'm a German Shepherd, I'm assuming lab because of the web feet. Ah, I go. She's still got a lot of anxiety today. But we've been stuck in the house and then with this diet change and she doesn't get her pup cups anymore. She's a little angry. And I'm just trying to move forward and enjoy my life. And it's so simple these days for me. I'm not, uh, I don't got a lot of demons left. I seem to have shoved them away. Now, the craziest other thing, which I also have a rock cast on, and it's called, uh, you can find all these in my playlist, Rock Cast 2.0, Hiking with Rock, but 
uh, I, uh, when I quit drink, dr uh, smoking weed, it turns out that your brain turns back on easy and you start having massive fucking dreams. A lot of nightmares and shit. Uh, you go into REM sleep, which again, you know, a lot of people use weed to go to sleep and that's great, but you really technically don't get the sleep that you would if you didn't. And, uh, when you quit smoking, all of a sudden you get some fucking dreams and by dreams, I mean, horribly realistic nightmares it only lasts about six weeks and when i really looked into it i was already at the five week mark so they're starting to taper off but whoo wee i had some fucking crazy shit and my philosophy or thoughts on it were well you know if i haven't been dreaming right then maybe my my rem memory hasn't caught up to uh the the madness and so when you stop swung a pot all of a sudden your brain's working through all the shit because it was like almost chronological for me in order you know it was uh hey slow down it was uh from like 14 till 49 it's a lot of shit to work through but i don't think i'd honestly really ever quit smoking weed in all those years not for any more than a couple hours even maybe a couple days hey get over here yeah i don't know if it's uh just my I'm not bragging or anything. I just I seem to have a really easily controlled brain, and uh, I'm feeling real positive today, and in a real motivated mode. And uh, it's either that or those blueberries and apples. Something's got me feeling fucking exceptional right now. That's a mix, you know. I like being motivated. I know. I also like being depressed and down. I'm really good at it. <laughs> Always have been. Just able to destroy my whole well-being with negative thoughts and shit anybody down there let's go down to the creek sit huh let's see if she's changed her attitude go towards the this is where i threw her in when she was a puppy she is she seems pretty good about it let's go go baby mm. what i hate about this stupid fucking ankle is always being so cautious you know what are you doing? Let's go. What's that? There's always frogs down here. Where there's any frogs. Looks like somebody built a little bridge. Yeah, let's go. No, look at her going right through the water. Good girl. Drink that. Yeah. Yeah, she's always afraid of drinking water. See if there's any frogs. There's always little frogs in here. Yeah. Ooh. Wow, somebody built a good little land bridge here. They did a good job. The Tunnel of Doom. Look at you go, baby. Be a brave girl. Ho, ho, ho. Let's go this way. What are you doing? Look at her go. Having such a good time. Having such a good time. Big brave girl. Yeah, she's not afraid of no water anymore. She's not afraid of no water no more. These are really big froggies in here. That's beautiful ass shit. Hey, why can't I see you? I'm sure there's gold in there. <sighs> Bring it here. Bring the ball. Go, baby girl. Drop it. Drop it. Yeah, squish, squish. Go. Good job. There we go. Nice pick. Nice pickup. Good girl. Good girl. Sit. Ooh, challenge. Whew. Good girl. Good girl. Gypsy Dirk. Zoom. That's a good catch, baby. Good job. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, well, first off, welcome to it. I don't know how you got here, but I appreciate you. And please do. I'm trying to get them up there. I'm at 100 or four, 341. That ain't bad. We could do better. Gypsy, drop it. All right, ready? You ready? Go. 
No matter what in this one, it goes off the trail. So you just got to look for them. Ew, I don't like the color of that water. Get that bar. There she goes. What a good girl. What a good girl. So in case you're wondering where I'm at, it's called Dixon Creek Waterfalls. It's uh, basically a Uland tree farm, which is a publicly owned tree farm. And uh, apparently quarry. Seems that they opened that up recently. Stop. And uh, it's really cool of these people to let people uh, come out here. And there's like, you know, there's this road. And then there's actual trails through the forest. A couple of really cool hidden trails. It goes away right now. I am at, uh, I've been walking for about 50 minutes. Uh, doesn't really say my distance on this damn thing. Let's see here. There it is. 1.15 miles. Oh, this is a good one. Ready? Sit. Sit. Go. Uh oh. See, it's always going into the trees. All right. Okay, we've made it to the thing. We got a little distracted and went down the trail there. I threw the ball for her a lot, and now we're going to take her down to the waterfall. Yet another place that she's generally terrified of. The biggest thing that gets her right now is just specifically the Winco parking lot. Now, you never know. Maybe one day when I went inside there, somebody slammed the truck with a cart. But yeah, she doesn't like those cart bins, you know, where they put all the carts after you're done with it. God, it's gorgeous in here. I love this part. This part coming up is nice. Now, this is a man-made waterfall to drain a swamp that's over here. Please keep a level. Let's see what the water levels are like today. Last time I was here, it was... Uh, very, very low. It's sounding very rambunctious right now. And I'm seeing quite the reflection of the water is up high. Oh, yeah, we're going to have a good waterfall today. Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, she's just a flowing swampy ass water. Oh, let me get a picture of that, though. Swampy but beautiful. I love all these trees and shit, man. Look at that. What are we doing, Gypsy? What are we doing? Oh, yeah. Good girl. Look at that bad boy. Oh, wow. See how, see how brave you are. What a good girl you are. What a big, brave girl you are. What is that? What is that? What is that? She's like straight up facing her fears right now. Good girl. Big brave girl. Oh, you go up, 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 up. Get on the log. You go up there. Where are you going to go? Where are you going to go? Up there. Go. Yeah. Little billy goat. Little billy goat. I am really proud of her, man. It's like a totally different dog. I'm really surprised by how well she's doing right now. That thing used to scare the shit out of her and she's actually just standing here taking it like a big girl. This is so fucking awesome right here. The summertime when it's really hot, hopefully I get her to swim in the water. She's not super happy about it, but she's not being completely a coward about it either. Gypsy, up. Up. Oh, pretty slick. Yeah. Let's get her some water. Look at you, mountain goat. Gypsy. Hi. What are you doing? Whoa. You want some water? Yeah, you do. You want some water. I'm going to get some footage of that just roaring on its own. I think when I brought Lisa here, it was super lame. I got to bring her here when it's like this. Look at that. That's just good footage right there. Let's shut up for a second and get that noise. Hey, baby. Yeah, get that water. Mmm, good girl.
Hey, where are you going? Hey. Yeah. What are you doing? Where is that water? Look how brave you are! Yeah! What is that? What is that, dear girl? What is that? Yeah! Yeah! I'm so proud of you! What a brave girl you are! Look at that day. Look at that day. That's incredible. I can't believe she's down with that. What a good girl. She's like, all right, dude, I did my thing. But daddy wants to sit here for a minute and contemplate life. What's down there? Go! Go! Pretty slick. Pretty slick. What are you doing? What are you doing? Come on! Look how brave you are! What happened to my little scaredy dog? What happened to my little scaredy gypsy? Big brave girl. Yeah. Go over there. Go. Can you jump? Go. Go! You can do it! So thanks for watching. I get with the rock. Go! You can do it! Jump! It's gonna be what my channel's about now, just getting out to places. I know we've already been here before, but there's so many trails off of this fucking area. And I mean, come on, man. It's just awesome. The wind coming off that waterfall. That's pure fucking power right there. Yeah, look at this dork. Look how brave she's been. Oh, how brave she's been. She's not afraid. She's not afraid no more. She's a big girl. What are you doing? Yeah. Get up there. Go. Up. It's just water. <laughs> That's what I like to see. You can't rush them, man. And hopefully soon this will be going away as we get out here more huh huh gypsy lynn so yeah we're gonna get out of here now go get more photos for my rotography and uh, i'm gonna really be pushing a lot of my creative stuff <laughs> look how good she is look how excited she is look how excited she is all right rot loves you all please subscribe to my channel uh, check out the playlist. You can also see that uh, what is up with my eyes right now? That was a trip. Going blind. Uh, and uh, go on, do it, do it. Get up there. I believe in you. I believe you can fly. And thanks for watching. I get with Rock. Rock loves you all. Goodbye.